Hello, friends. My name is Dr. Puru Dhawan. And today in this video, I will explain why kidney failure patients should avoid coconut in their diet. Kidney plays a very important role in our body. Kidney excrete all metabolic waste and keeps the body clean. But when kidneys function gets affected by diabetes or high blood pressure, waste materials like creatinine, urea, and potassium start accumulating in our blood. These increased levels of waste material, especially creatinine, give an idea of how much your kidney is working. And that's why increased levels of creatinine are considered lethal. But only a few patients know that potassium is much more lethal than creatinine. When creatinine increases, the patient only suffers from muscle cramps, fatigue, and weakness-like problems, but no major damage happens. But when potassium increases it can cause heart attack-like severe situation. Now, it's very important to understand, what are the functions of potassium in our body? When potassium is in the normal range, it gives power to muscles to move, power to expand and contract. But when potassium increases beyond the normal range it gives muscle fatigue. Now you may think that how it gonna be more lethal than creatinine. Our heart, which pumps all blood in our body. Through contraction and expansion of heart muscles. Heart starts feeling fatigue. When the level of potassium increases, this fatigue's heart may go under cardiac arrest if potassium levels go above 7. I am sure now you know how dangerous potassium can be when it is there in high amounts. If a kidney failure patient consumes coconut water then potassium levels in the blood may increase because coconut water is rich in potassium and the kidneys are not functioning well and kidneys are now unable to balance electrolytes in the blood. This increased level of potassium makes the heart muscles fatigue and may cause death in kidney failure patients. Now the question that arises here is, how can we control potassium? Potassium is present in each and every food item, in some food items it is low and in some, it is plenty. So, we have to take only those food items that contain potassium either in a low amount or moderate. For that, I am giving you a link to one of my video to explain everything about potassium. You can watch after this video. I hope now you know how lethal is potassium in high amount and why we should avoid coconut in kidney failure patients. If you still have any doubt, you may contact my doctor's team, they will help you out with your condition. I hope you like this video. If you like this video, then press the like button on your screen. If you want to watch more informative videos, then subscribe our channel and press the bell icon for more updates. If you found this video informative, then you can also share our video with your friends and relatives. With this allow me to say goodbye, see you in the next video.